The Texas prison inmate who escaped nearly three weeks ago still on the run tonight. Officers say 46-year-old Gonzalo Lopez somehow got out of his shackles, cut through a metal cage on a prison bus, then stabbed a guard, then disappeared into the woods near Centerville, two hours north of Houston. Tonight, U.S. Marshals hope photos of Lopez's tattoos we just showed you help lead to his capture. Our Matt Doherty went to Centerville today. He is the very latest. The Texas Department of Criminal Justice says it does not have any new information to give us tonight. As we found out earlier today, correctional officers are looking in the same spot where this all began. As we drove the winding roads near the spot where Gonzalo Lopez escaped on May the 12th, the TDCJ presence is obvious. One after another, we saw the department's vehicles with the blue logos on the sides continuing to patrol this remote area of Leon County. The U.S. Marshal Service released these photos of Gonzalo Lopez showing the extensive number of tattoos covering his body. The Office of Investigator General states the word Mexicano is scrolled across his back. Also on his back, skulls, an eagle, Aztec art, a shield, and the word Aztlan on the right side of his neck is a burn scar. On his upper right arm, his name, Lopez, a prison tower, male and female faces, and clown faces. On his chest, a tattoo of the Grim Reaper and skulls. On his abdomen, his nickname, Gonzo. Lopez was serving a life sentence for capital murder when he escaped from the prison transport bus earlier this month. He's considered armed and dangerous. A $50,000 reward is being offered to anyone who can provide information that leads to his capture. In Houston, I'm Matt Doherty, KHOU 11 News.